the world first started seeing spectacular images of the cosmos captured by the powerful James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, launched by NASA. This ambitious and groundbreaking project has once again revolutionized our understanding of the universe by sending back a series of astonishing new images. These latest visuals have stunned scientists and enthusiasts alike, providing insights that challenge existing theories and open up new realms of exploration unlike anything we have ever witnessed before. These images offer us a glimpse into the most distant and enigmatic regions of the cosmos, pushing the boundaries of human knowledge to uncharted territories. Before we start, hit the like and subscribe buttons for more exclusive news. The JWST, designed to be the successor to the Hubble Space Telescope, has exceeded expectations with its advanced infrared capabilities. This allows it to peer deeper into the universe than any other instrument before it. While Hubble provided breathtaking views of the universe in visible light, the James Webb Telescope primarily operates in the infrared spectrum. This capability enables it to cut through cosmic dust clouds and reveal the secrets of star formation, black holes, and early galaxy development. The telescope's latest images have uncovered areas of the universe that were previously hidden from us, offering new data about phenomena that have long puzzled astronomers. One of the most significant images returned by the JWST shows an area of space so distant that it dates back to only a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. This period in cosmic history, known as the Dark Ages of the Universe, has been largely shrouded in mystery. During this time, the first stars and galaxies began to form, and the universe started to emerge from its primordial state. For the first time, scientists are seeing evidence of these earliest structures with unprecedented clarity, allowing them to piece together the events that shaped the early universe. In these new images, dense clouds of gas and dust, stellar nurseries, can be seen giving birth to stars. These regions are among the most turbulent and chaotic in the universe, where gravity pulls together immense amounts of matter to ignite the nuclear reactions that form stars. The JWST has captured intricate details of this process, showing stars in various stages of their formation and offering a window into the life cycle of stars in a way that has never been possible before. By studying these images, Astronomers can learn about the conditions under which stars are born and how these processes have changed over billions of years. In addition to stellar nurseries, the James Webb Telescope has also captured images of distant galaxies, many of which have never been seen before. These galaxies are located so far away that their light has taken billions of years to reach us, meaning we are seeing them as they appeared when the universe was still in its infancy. The telescope's unparalleled resolution has revealed complex structures within these galaxies, including massive black holes at their centers and star clusters that are far older than our own Milky Way. These black holes are particularly fascinating because they challenge our current understanding of how these objects form and grow. Some of the black holes observed in these images are much larger and more active than scientists expected them to be at such an early stage in the universe's history. Theories about how black holes grow typically suggest that they start as small, dense objects that slowly accumulate mass over time by consuming surrounding matter. However, the JWST data suggests that some black holes may have formed fully grown or experienced rapid growth, forcing astronomers to reconsider their models of black hole evolution. The images of these early galaxies also raise questions about how galaxies themselves form and evolve. Some of the galaxies seen by the JWST are remarkably well-structured, with defined spiral arms and central bulges, despite being so young in cosmic terms. This level of organization is surprising, as it was previously believed that galaxies in the early universe would be more chaotic and irregular in shape due to the violent processes involved in their formation. The discovery of these well-formed galaxies suggests that galaxy formation may occur much more quickly than previously thought which has profound implications for our understanding of the universe's early years. The JWST has also provided a stunning new perspective on some of the most mysterious objects in the cosmos, exoplanets. These are planets that orbit stars outside of our solar system, and while thousands of exoplanets have been discovered over the past few decades, we still know very little about their atmospheres and potential for supporting life. The James Webb Telescope's infrared capabilities have allowed scientists to study the chemical compositions of exoplanet atmospheres in greater detail than ever before. Some of the new images and data have revealed surprising findings, 
including the presence of water vapor, methane, and other organic molecules on certain exoplanets. These discoveries are particularly exciting because they bring us closer to answering one of the most profound questions in science. Are we alone in the universe? The presence of organic molecules in an exoplanet's atmosphere does not necessarily mean that life exists on these planets, but it does suggest that the building blocks of life are more common in the universe than previously thought. These findings could eventually lead to the identification of habitable worlds beyond our solar system, potentially changing the way we think about life in the cosmos. The JWST's new images also provide crucial insights into the end stages of stellar life. The telescope has captured detailed views of supernova remnants, vast, colorful clouds of gas and dust left behind after a star explodes. These remnants are not only beautiful but also scientifically important, as they are the sites where many of the heavier elements in the universe are created. When a star goes supernova, it generates immense amounts of energy, which fuses lighter elements like hydrogen and helium into heavier elements like carbon, oxygen, and iron. These elements are then scattered across space, becoming part of new stars, planets, and eventually life itself. The James Webb Space Telescope's new images, which delve into the earliest chapters of the universe's existence, have opened a window into a time and place we previously could only imagine. What makes these images especially inspiring is not just their beauty, but their ability to unlock secrets of the cosmos that were once completely out of reach. These never-before-seen scenes of distant galaxies, nebulae, and cosmic structures are forcing us to rethink what we thought we knew about the universe. While the images of distant galaxies and exotic phenomena have captured the public imagination, one of the most surprising discoveries made by the JWST involves objects much closer to home, the outer reaches of our own solar system. The telescope's infrared sensors have been able to study the icy worlds at the edges of the solar system, revealing new details about their composition and surface features. For example, the telescope captured a detailed image of Pluto's moon Charon, revealing a complex landscape of icy plains and mountain ranges that had previously been invisible to us. These observations of the outer solar system could help scientists understand the formation of planetary bodies in cold, distant regions of space. The Kuiper Belt, a vast region of space beyond Neptune that contains thousands of icy objects, has long been a mystery to astronomers. The JWST's ability to study these objects in detail could provide new insights into how planets form in the outer reaches of solar systems, offering clues about how our own solar system came to be. Beyond individual discoveries, the James Webb Space Telescope is also helping to answer one of the biggest questions in astronomy. How did the universe evolve into its current state? By capturing images of galaxies, stars, and planets at various stages of development, the telescope is helping to create a timeline of cosmic history. These observations allow scientists to track the evolution of galaxies and stars over billions of years, providing a more complete picture of the universe's past, present, and future. One of the key discoveries from the JWST's latest images is the realization that the universe's early years were much more dynamic than previously thought. The images show galaxies forming at a faster rate than expected, with intense bursts of star formation occurring in rapid succession. This challenges the long-standing view that the early universe was relatively quiet and that galaxy formation occurred slowly over billions of years. Instead, it appears that the first few hundred million years after the Big Bang were a period of intense activity, with galaxies rapidly forming and evolving in ways that scientists are only now beginning to understand. The James Webb Space Telescope's ability to look so far back in time is due in large part to its extraordinary sensitivity. By observing in the infrared spectrum, the telescope can detect the faintest signals of light that have traveled billions of light years across space. This light, emitted by stars and galaxies in the early universe, has been stretched and redshifted over time as the universe expands. The JWST's ability to capture this ancient light allows scientists to see objects that are so far away their light has taken nearly the entire age of the universe to reach us. In addition to looking deep into the past, the JWST is also providing a new perspective on the structure of the universe itself. The images reveal vast cosmic webs of dark matter and galaxies stretching across the universe like a spider's web. These webs, shaped by the gravitational pull of dark matter, are the backbone of the universe's large-scale structure. 
By mapping these structures, scientists hope to better understand the role that dark matter plays in the formation and evolution of galaxies. The JWST images provide a clearer view of these cosmic webs than ever before, offering new clues about the nature of dark matter and its influence on the universe. As the James Webb Space Telescope continues to send back new images, it is becoming increasingly clear that we are entering a new era of discovery in astronomy. The telescope's ability to see further and more clearly than any previous instrument is revolutionizing our understanding of the cosmos, providing answers to age-old questions while raising new ones. Each new image reveals a universe that is more complex and beautiful than we ever imagined, full of wonders that challenge our understanding of space, time, and the fundamental nature of reality. One of the most fascinating aspects of these new discoveries is how they challenge existing models of cosmic development. Take, for example, the notion of cosmic inflation, a rapid expansion of the universe immediately following the Big Bang. While the concept has been widely accepted, JWST discoveries are revealing that the universe's early years may have been far more dynamic than previously thought. The unprecedented detail provided by the JWST of the first galaxies, formed within the first few hundred million years after the Big Bang, suggests that galaxy formation might have occurred more rapidly and under more intense conditions than standard inflationary models predict. These early galaxies, far from being small and unorganized as once assumed, appear to be much more structured. They exhibit properties such as high star formation rates and are composed of materials that indicate an advanced chemical makeup. These findings imply that the universe was able to evolve more quickly than models had anticipated, forcing astrophysicists to reevaluate their assumptions about how stars and galaxies formed in the universe's first few billion years. Moreover, the discovery of early supermassive black holes, a phenomenon observed in some of these distant galaxies, presents another significant challenge. Scientists have long puzzled over how such massive black holes could have formed so early in the universe's history, Given that black holes are typically thought to form from the collapse of massive stars, a process that would presumably take longer than what these early black holes seem to suggest. JWST's sharp imaging capabilities have revealed evidence of black holes with millions of times the mass of the Sun, which existed when the universe was less than a billion years old. This remarkable discovery raises important questions about how black holes can grow so rapidly in such a short span of time. These observations also provide a critical new perspective on the role that black holes may have played in shaping the early universe. The energy released by growing black holes, in the form of radiation and powerful jets of charged particles, could have influenced the formation and evolution of galaxies. This interaction between supermassive black holes and their host galaxies is an area of research that the JWST images have helped to illuminate. By studying these early black holes and their impact on surrounding gas and stars, scientists can begin to understand how galaxies were shaped in the first billion years of the universe's history. But black holes and galaxies aren't the only mysterious entities illuminated by JWST's cutting-edge instruments. The telescope is also bringing clarity to one of the universe's most elusive components. Dark matter, the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, is not just uncovering cosmic phenomena. It is also providing critical data that informs our understanding of fundamental astrophysical processes. For instance, the telescope's observations of the cosmic microwave background have enhanced our insights into the universe's early conditions, shedding light on its expansion history and the nature of dark energy. This background radiation, a relic from the Big Bang, is essential for piecing together the timeline of cosmic evolution. Additionally, the JWST is helping to refine our models of stellar evolution. By observing different types of stars at various life stages, astronomers can analyze the processes that govern stellar nucleosynthesis, the formation of heavier elements within stars. This research is vital for understanding how elements necessary for life are distributed throughout the universe. Moreover, the JWST's ability to capture the atmospheres of exoplanets using transit methods allows researchers to examine seasonal changes and atmospheric dynamics. Such detailed observations could lead to the discovery of potential biosignatures, which are indicators that life could exist on these distant worlds.